uh, welcome to uh, to the Overseas Development Institute. Uh, my name is uh, Dirk Tevelde. I'm head of the International Economic Development Group here at ODI. Uh, welcome to the meeting on uh, global value chains in Asia. Is everyone benefiting? Grand title. I hope at least that everyone, everybody here, uh, will be benefiting from this uh, this meeting. And also uh, welcome to the um, the people uh, who are watching online. Uh, and we are outnumbered by the people watching online. Mm -hmm. And I hope they're benefiting from uh, ODI's uh, global value chain um, so that they, they, um, they can also watch us uh, speak. Um, we, um, uh, the meeting today is on, uh, on global value chains and I think there are uh, sort of three core questions. Um, the question is uh, who benefits from the, the emergence of global value chains? Um, and global value chains is sort of a, a new topic uh, um, that uh, that has uh, uh, gotten more attention recently. Although, of course, uh, value chains have existed uh, for for quite some time. But the question really is, who who benefits from from the emergence of global value chains? And um, uh, secondly, um, those who have uh, uh, who have uh, benefited, how how did they do that? Um, how did they take place? Uh, uh, that they take part in value chains, and um, and in particular we look at uh, the case of East Asia, and uh, and then thirdly uh, the question then then becomes that that those people who who have uh, gained from uh, from value chains and have participated in global value chains, um, can we uh, sort of uh, distill the main main lessons and think about the uh, the experience uh, that that they have had. In participating in, in value chains, and can we then replicate it elsewhere uh, so that those that initially didn't benefit uh, can still benefit? Um, so I'm very pleased that we have uh, a panel of four, uh, four excellent speakers here to uh, to talk about this particular topic. Um, the first speaker uh, is uh, uh, Dr. Ganesh Vignaraya, and he is um, a director of research at the uh, uh, African uh, Asian. <laughs> Development Bank Institute, and um, we've been working with Ganesh for uh, for quite some time over the over the years, and we're very happy that you uh, you have once again chosen ODI to uh, um, to, to talk uh, about your most recent uh, uh, work. Um, we then uh, have um, uh, three discussants who approach the uh, the topic um, from from their angles. Um, first of all, we'll uh, we'll hear from. Uh, from uh, Jody Keane, who is uh, here at ODI and is the, uh, the resident expert on, on value chains uh, from an analytical perspective, but she's also worked in, uh, in, uh, in Cambodia on a particular garment sector and value chain, so we would also hear from her uh, on, on, on this particular uh, value chain. And then we <coughs> move to uh, Yurendra Bosnet, who is um, also uh, at the Overseas Development Institute, a research fellow, just like Jody Keane, and he uh, has done some uh, some excellent work on uh, uh, on Nepal and um, looking at economic transformation and industrial policy, and also hearing from the, ex the experience on, uh, of uh, of Nepal and whether they've benefited. Uh, and then, lastly, we'll uh, we'll turn to uh, Franz Lammersen, who is the the principal administrator at the Development Cooperation Directorate at the OECD, and we've also been working uh, over time with. Uh, with France on various aspects on uh, on aid for trade, and he will talk uh, particularly about sort of what uh, what uh, can we do can we as uh, uh, international community uh, or domestic uh, uh, stakeholders, but also donors, uh, do uh, to uh, to support countries in uh, in taking part of uh, value chains and benefiting from it. Um, so we've got four uh, four speakers. Um, uh, my suggestion is that uh, the lead speaker, Ganesh, uh, gets uh, about 20 minutes, and then uh, we hear from the other speakers uh, about 10 minutes each, um, so that we should be uh, uh, done with the presentations within an hour. Um, so it's going to be a bit, bit longer than uh, maybe the usual uh, uh, ODI meeting. Um, uh, but then we've got uh, more than an hour to discuss um, the, the issues that come up, um, whether uh, global value chains are really something new, whether uh, it, it, it really has uh, leads to different policy implications um, and so on, uh, and whether it is really something that, uh, that we should all be, uh, be concerned about um, and, um, uh, uh, and, and a number of other questions we can, we can then, um, then discuss. So we have between one and three. Um, I, I, I suggest we start with, um, with Ganesh 
uh, with the first presentation. So uh, over to you uh, for the first 20 minutes.